quite a number of drugs that are of concern for uh, CMT patients as well as anyone uh, that may cause neuropathy or produce uh, symptoms of neuropathy such as weakness or numbness. Out of the enormous number of medications approved in the United States, only a very small number are uh, problematic or uh, likely to cause neuropathy. And of those, there are certain ones that are uh, of, of higher risk than others. Uh, as a general concept, the uh, categories of chemotherapy for cancer treatment and certain antibiotics are, are most concerning. Uh, even of chemotherapy drugs, only a small percentage are known to cause neuropathy or make neuropathy worse. Uh, especially for CMT patients with the most common form, uh, one particular drug, uh, vincristin, which is used in a variety of cancer treatments and included in a variety of uh, combination treatments of cancer, uh, can be, uh, is, is uh, something that is uh, uh, known to cause more damage to nerves than in other patients. Uh, and, and it's something that even patients that uh, don't know they have CMT or have a CMT uh, known in a relative uh, can, uh, can make the problem uh, much worse even after one or two doses, where in general it takes a course of treatment to, to produce uh, uh, notable uh, symptoms. Yes, um, there, there has been a list of drugs created uh, and ranked by the likelihood of causing uh, uh, nerve damage. There are some medications that will cause some degree of nerve damage in anyone who takes them if they take a high enough dose or take it for long enough, and others that very rarely or uh, controversially may cause any trouble at all. So there is a list and it's relevant for anyone with neuropathy but is particularly important with uh, patients with CMT and that list is uh, published and, and widely available. Uh, there are always uh, drugs coming out uh, on the market that have, not, that, that have been tested, but uh, not always in the number of patients needed to, to find uh, uncommon events. And certainly new chemotherapy drugs are coming out uh, every year. And in fact, there have been two new drugs added to the list uh, this year for, uh, for newly released uh, medications. Um, so, uh, so there may be drugs uh, that are of potential risk not on, not on the list.